Hello everyone and welcome to Streaming with Steven, where once again we are playing Minecraft, once again on the Citadel. And this week we are continuing to work on the Lava Tunnel Bridge, you can see over there. Um, the reason why I'm up here again to show you is because I did not want to uh, die. <laughs> Cosmic Post coming into the stream. Sounds good! Yosu. Ooh, see Yosu. Alright, so today, I also wanted to be up here just so gas didn't blow me out while I was trying to talk to you. We've got the sort of, I'm calling it the foundation, but the mold essentially is, has been, has been dug out. And so we are going to go down. Have a closer look at this. Oh yes, I forgot my door is gone. And I already hear a ghast. Gosh, darn it. Not how I wanted to start a stream, but... If ghasts are not... Can I say that? If ghasts are nigh, or ghasts are nearby. Alright, thankfully that didn't hit any pig creatures. Hey Firepith, welcome to the chat. Sorry I didn't uh, comment right away. Always a pleasure to have you there. Should have a couple more doors in here. It's the only I had to have made three. Hmm. All right. Strange. Perhaps the doors are at the top. It would be a strange place to put them, but I wouldn't put it past myself. Excuse me. Uh, except that I did not do that. All right, we're just gonna go make another door and wait. We have. I need you. Just take both of you for now. Okay. First thing we'll do is get a door on this, so that we can um actually close ourselves in if need be. That's a lot. First thing we're gonna do is actually fix that because that was annoying me. That's a super unfortunate uh, last moment with the the gas at the end of last stream. Oh, we don't see it up there, so that's good. And then we'll take those since we need to make the door. Oh, it's gonna be that picky. Fine. And so it's been a while since I've made doors, so I just could not recall if they needed sticks or anything like that. Alright, so then we can go back in there, pick up those eggs that we do not need. Actually, I wonder if uh, lava wise, if that's full. It is full, so we just don't need these lava buckets. We just need to get these out before we get. Oops. Really, just not gonna let me do anything? It is too much lava. Oh, come on. There we go. to free up some room since we have, I believe, all the lava we need. Okay. We'll put these buckets back and then we'll just, uh, how's the music? I'm just going to turn the music down a tiny bit. It seems a bit loud in my ears, so. Well, there's the buckets over here. And then we'll just throw the extra sand in here because we don't need any sand right now. And we'll be able to get most of that sand back. Uh, I'm not sure. And I do. Well, Alistair with a bunch of sand, so we can always give some back to him. Macky cream. Don't need that on me. Alright. 
All right, all right, all right. So what we need to what we need to do is grab a bunch of basalt because I want this to look like a dead tree. Like it's going to be this a giant like this that toppled over and made this tunnel bridge. So we're now, without further ado, we're just going to get right to it. Actually, I do want to do a bit of a count so that I know how much I need. Um, three. So one, two, three. That was stupid. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And times three, so 30, 60. Oh, it flies in the game. <laughs> Welcoming him to the game. So we got, so that's 30. Let's pretend it's 32 for the sake of being able to uh, make it easy in terms of stacks. So 32, 64. So one stack, two stacks, two and a half stacks, just to cover the floor, means probably five or six stacks to leave. And then when I say that, probably even more. So we're just going to go get some basalt so that we can start doing that. All right, and I have resources here I can come back and get. It's a bunch of basalt off in the distance, so. I would love to sort of make my life easier and just go for the basalt that's right there, but as my my sons pointed out, this is pretty cool looking right there, so best to go off into the distance and uh, is pillage from an area that won't affect the look of my area. Oh yes, and we just had some of Alistair's British jacket potatoes. Delicious as always. Oh crap. What's going on there? Do I not have any gold on me? This is not good. I should have checked my gold boots before I... Yep, I have no gold on me. There we go. First time that's happened, but sort of a lesson learned. So, not getting basalt first. Getting some new booties first. Hey Cosmic, welcome to the chat. <laughs> Terrible at Minecraft. You are not. Uh, do I have any actual gold? Um, I don't think that's enough to actually make any any boots, though. No. I can make a basalt generator. Yes, you've told me, but I have not had the chance to look into it, so it's... I, didn't, I mean no disrespect, but I'm not going to do anything with that. <laughs> Fire Pith moderating his brother. brother. Dear brother, all the old caps necessary. I just got those pants on in time. Close. Is it possible? Forget. Alright, might regret this in a second, but. Nope. Alright, gold pants it is. And then we will just get some more gold later. She <laughs> Alistair, she was on the verge of bolting anyway, just because <laughs> she had an unfortunate encounter with a skelly. And we're off. Basalt, some basalt. I don't think it hurt to actually grab some gold and occasionally when we see it now that I am low on it. Oh, interesting. Okay, cave area down there. 
That's neat. Cool. All right. Um, where best to take it from? Perhaps right here. I wish I could say it's safe to say that I will not have any lava pour on me if I take it from the top. Who knows when you're in the nether? Oh. That's off. It is. I'm very much looking... It's going to make a great looking dead tree. Also realized that's a super good idea. Oh no, that's a drag. Hopefully my internet plays nice tonight. Had uh, far too many disconnections last time for my liking. Of course, as I say that, I end up with a little bit of a stutter there. I know that they're cute, but they do cause damage, and I don't really want to have to deal with damage right now. Let's see if I can sort of take this down and... Uh, that's a good question. I hope not. Ah! Oh, come on. Why are you doing this? Oh, no! Really, four hits. Dang. I guess the question is now, where am I going to respawn? In the desert. All right. Um, let's see if we can mad dash it back over there and grab my gold boots, because that's the only gold I have. <laughs> well, there you go, folks. No death by lava yet, but death by magma cube. That was unexpected. Rip indeed, McFly, rip indeed. Pay no attention to the uh, the uh, armorless dude streaking through here. Yes, indeed, the night of death. This is my coffee hallway. I always take a sip of coffee when I'm running down this hallway. For I can run without need to touch the mouse. Oops. Thankfully, I hadn't gone off in some crazy long-distance excursion. A perfect spot for some stairs. Compliments, I believe, of CJ. Oh, hopefully I didn't lose too much of my um, basalt I gathered. Oh, ah. Oh, right. <laughs> I forgot about that. Oh, no. Hopefully the ghasts don't see me over here. Otherwise, this is going to be super unfortunate. Oh, it's still up there. No, it's not. Fantastic. Wait, that was over there. Oh, come on. Nope, oh, leave me alone. Leave me alone. Alright. Mostly everything. Still around. Alright, cool. Let's get the uh, stuff back on. Uh, shield? Do I still have my shield? You can never see my shield, it's always frustrating. Oh yeah, there it is. 
Oh no, I lost my bow though. Shoot. So I have no way to bend off any uh whatchamacallits. Ghasts should they arrive. Look over there. This is not the uh, situation I'm going to find myself in. I'm just going to keep my back to the wall here and hope. The gas does not come over. <laughs> I think that dude actually just jumped right over here. All right. As I was saying earlier, no death by lava, but one death nonetheless. We're gonna have a little bit of a choppy, uh, choppy view here. So we have one, two stacks. And we wanted to get at least a third of at least three. Sort of is the official uh, official measurement. Can I get a sorta, of, please? Sweet dreams, McFly. Sweet dreams. Ah. I was almost. That was almost, uh, oh, well, maybe not into the lava, but pretty darn close. All right, almost the three stacks. Then we can head back at least get this first part of the let's just take this whole area. I go back and forth if we don't have to. Right? Right. Oops. Hey CJ, welcome to the chat. Glad you can make it. I am doing well this evening, thank you very much. As per uh, Thursday night stream, I'm still a bit tired, but not nearly as tired as then. Thankfully. But otherwise, doing well. Thank you very much. How are you? Oh, come on. So I was saying those little ones are cute, but when they come and they try to knock you off the side, they are they are just as deadly as the big ones. It's kind of neat to have a an unintended little bridge over this way. I'll take it. Oh, you. Come on, just one little dude. There's no need. Dude, it's trouble. Oh, 
Well, that sounds pretty cool. I uh, apologize. I'm sure you've told me before, but I can't remember. So you're in, sorry, CJ. You were in New York City. How far away is that from where you live? I forget. Where you, I think you did tell us, but. This is definitely more than I need right right away for the first part of it, but better to get it all now. And I think this will give me a bridge directly back so I don't have to go all the way around the lava, which will be nice. Oops. Don't need that to be unburied. All right, we'll pick it up. Oh, jeez, it is a long day. I'm glad you were, uh, glad you made it for a bit of the chat and the stream. That's awesome. My commute, thankfully, isn't that long, but it used to be. I used to have to go. Uses an Enderman party over there. It used to be long going over to help. Um, Going into university, an hour or more each each way, but you know, greatly simplified from what it used to be. This is choppy, 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 choppy. Don't like that. Hmm. Might be worthwhile taking some of this down so it's easier to get over. Maybe this just this top area. Maybe it just not so much that it needs to be taken down, just need to be well, that's obnoxious. Gotta at least have the green going in the right direction. There we go. Yeah, sorry, this is a really choppy stream. Not the best connection ever. I should even check to see how many I have. Okay, one, two, three, four, basically six stacks. Oh yeah, that totally makes sense. I know. Total ender party. Bad pun alert. You could say it's a party to end your all parties. <laughs> oh, sorry, I'll let myself out. Unacceptable, Steven! Alright, so let's uh Haunting of Enderman. I keep forgetting that. This is pretty awesome. This is what I'm doing. I'm making the polished basalt because I feel like it looks more like, you know, I'm not the only one too, but it looks more like a log. So this will be the dead tree on its side look. Uh... Zan, there we go. All right. Start uh, putting down some wood. Dead wood. Although, start on this side. Hmm, we run into some sort of cosmetic. Weird just because you can't do. I don't think you can do it anyway. There's no way to make a four-sided one like you normally can wood, right? No, all right. 
Oops. We need that. Don't throw it away. So we're just basically going to have to. Have, we're going to have some anomalies. Like I'm not going to be able to put. Oh, that reminds me. Um, one of you there. I think there's just one. Oh, Netherrack. How did you end up there? Alright. Alright. That's good. And I did make doors specifically so that I could come over here and put them in, but we'll just leave it for now. We shall continue on with the dead tree. I guess I'll have to start from this side on this one. Oh, an imperfection. That was not supposed to be there. No. That pattern is wrong. Okay, we'll go to the side. Three, one, two, three. Too. Oh, maybe that is correct. Is this supposed to sort of widen off like. Alright, we need to fill some of this nonsense in. Not you. What's nonsense right there? Hmm. Dude, you're making this hard for me. Or are you? Whoa, oh, oh, oh. Bye, piggy. I forget what I was going to do now. So one, two, three. Hmm. All right. Oh, I thought it was just going to do three, but now I'm wondering if I want to do four. This count there as well. Bad, Steven. Yeah, there's the mistake right there. I put them all down and I'll dig out the imperfections later. Ah! Stop it! Rude! Maybe we should maybe we should do the floor. We don't have to do with uh, all the slow soul stone. Oh, actually, I don't want to do that yet. That's right. That's why I'm not doing that. I haven't decided on what I want the floor to be exactly because part of me wants to do um, basalt everywhere, and then there's part of me that wants to do. Um, of a mixture of netherrack with with nylium on it and regular basalt so i shouldn't have actually gone crazy with the basalt like i did no oh. to add a bit more sand which I left behind of course oh actually I need food desperately oh my gosh need some Alistair's dish jacket potatoes lovely 
Alright, so we need some of the sand. Basically, just I need to have. No, let's just use another rack. I'm going to be so uh, flip flopping on my decisions here, but. I feel like sand is more. useful if, if I lose. I don't. I would like to say yes, but I don't know what that is offhand. I'm sure I've probably seen it, I just don't know what that is. Without going back to take another look. I mean, if it's just a retexturing he did of it, I probably will get it at some point. Just don't recall what it is offhand, or what it looks like. Oops. I like that sound. I know I'm a bit of a broken record on this, but as I mentioned before, one of the reasons why we're doing this in Basalt is because it's got enough blast protection from... Enough of a blast protection from ghasts down here. Should, anyway. I don't even see it. That's my least favorite thing. Hearing it but not being able to see it. Oh, thanks. Oh, crap. Okay, I'm wondering now if I have... Uh... I'm not leave myself any stairs to get out. Oh my goodness, Cosmic, no worries at all. Thanks for popping in. Have yourself a wonderful night and get a good night's sleep. Oh, I did have another bow. Appreciate you stopping by all the time, as always. Alright, so that... Did work as expected in the sense that the basalt stopped it but the other thing it did not Alright, let me try. Once I get this wall up as a bit of a protection, then I'm going to try. Oh, it was. Uh, yeah, I want to try to see if I can do something with the floor so I don't have to hop over the soul sand and. Um, magma, magma cubes. Or magma blocks, whatever they call it. Alright. 
This is weird having the bottoms on it like this. Uh, there's part of me that's not really sure how I feel about that. I'm just gonna uh, forget honestly if I have any basalt over here already. Oh my goodness, I did. That was silly of me. I had grabbed a bunch of it already. All right. Well, at least I can now. I can take that and try it. I don't need the iron on me. Just want to see what the floor looks like. That's where it is. I'm going to totally miss that. Come on. That's what I'm hoping. Thank you. And then I might just sort of switch it up every once in a while with... I'm just kind of curious what it would look like switching back and forth between the two. I'm not sure how I feel about this, though, because it has a definite directionality to it, which I'm not sure I'm a fan of. Oops. This will just make then this will make the navigating back and forth a lot easier. So I'm going to do this for now, and then I'll probably switch it up. Maybe what I'll do is get some of the uh, blackstone as well, because that's you know they're they are mixed together over there. But for the footpath, maybe switching back and forth between basalt and blackstone will look nice. Oh, I didn't grab enough. <laughs> grab two of them just in case. Just in case. Alright, thanks CJ. That's what we'll look at doing. Oh, come on. Why are you doing this? Alright, uh, actually just give me one second. I'm going to go just switch my Wi-Fi the other frequency and back because it's giving me some weird kind of lag spikes and hide in here for a second so one moment i apologize if anything disconnects at all but this it usually doesn't it usually allows me to flip from one minor hiccup and then back to the other one so all right and back we go again Let's see how this does. Nope. That's what I was wondering. Alright. Hang tight there. We're going to uh and we'll reconnect to Oh my goodness, that's a lot better though. Okay, cool. Thanks, Alistair. Good to be back. That's uh Unfortunately, I get booted off, but this is a lot, a lot more responsive already. Or so I say. Feels like it was done wrong. Maybe it just feels a bit wrong because it's not um it's 
still has the sand and stuff around it. Hmm. Alright, I'm just going to fill all this in as we were going to do anyway. Safety first, so to speak, so we'll get all of this. So I want it. It's going to be just a, probably a bit of back and forth, building up and tearing down until I can get it to look like it's a fallen tree. But even then, I don't know how how much of a fallen tree it's going to look like. Oh well. We will continue along with the plan. Wait a minute. I don't know why I jumped over to this side suddenly. <laughs> um, Again, I just need another little backings in order to stack up my the next row of basalt on it. Ah, uh, garbage. You can still see me? No. No, please don't hit my tree. Well. Not quite enough to fill this all in. Most unfortunate. You just have to give me a run for my money there. Oops. That goes back there. I like having you there. Yay! Intact. Exactly why we wanted to do that. Beautiful. This is basically, oops, going to have the same same structure as the other. Oh my goodness! I swear I'm not drinking. This keeps happening. Same structure as that big tree up there, as though, as I mentioned before, as though a giant its giant twin fell over. Oh, right, that's what happened. I did not get those last couple in. Hmm. Let's take these out. Like the base of the other one, have it flare out to the sides a little bit. Um, actually, that's supposed to come in one more. There. I do believe it was. Come on. Yeah, still some weirdness going on. I don't know what's. I hate to sound all blamey on the server and stuff like that, but it is not behaving as I would like it to. Oh, here, I just need to fill it in with. I'll just have it end there for now and I'll come back to it. Alright, so then we're gonna need you.
And then what I want to do is... Oh, that's not right. Basically... Have it enclose over the top, like... The tree as well. So it's not going to be a full tunnel. I want it to look... A little... Like a rotted tree, so it's not going to be 100% covered the entire way. So that there could be the chance that a... Uh, Gast could see in at you, but if it decides to attack, it won't be laying waste to the entire tree. What we'll do is just. Oh, that's why. Stairs! <laughs> it's been a while since we've, done, since we've done the stair command. Um, in my. Oops! My thinking was that it was right here, so I am going to sort of try to recreate a bit of a gouge in the area here to make it look like it was um, had fallen over. Um, but we shall see. Right, had a brain failure there. What's going on? Your brain works. And that, and that. Okay. I know we don't have much power left in this bow, but let's see if we can see where this is coming from before it sees me. I got some weird choppiness going again. I think I'm gonna, it feels like I'm going to get booted off the server yet again. Sorry for all the swirling around, folks. I'm just trying to not get shot at. Oh, you dirty rotten. There we go. Oh no, I hit them. I hit the pigs. Well, this, this is going to be a drag. Not what you would do on this one. It was good, but unfortunately, in one of my overshots, I clearly hit some pigs, and now they're uh, they're displeased with me. <laughs> I'm curious to see how many are gathered at the bottom of the tree now. One thing I've never looked into is how long is the cooldown period for pigs that are whoa. Where did you come from? I don't need that. I do not need pigs inside my house. Alright, well that's going to put a bit of a damper on my um, bridge building. On the plus side, I can, I can get a bit of a experience points. <laughs> Why not? Okay, maybe I'll do that then.
Well, all right. Does anyone have any idea how long it takes them for them to lose the interest? Apparently I have to be careful that there are none up here. Alright, well, bear with me. I'm just going to, uh... Okay, I'm going to do a quick, uh, a quick relog here, so just one second. I'm actually going to quit Minecraft altogether and log back in because I'm still getting weird, weird, um, whatchamacallit, just gl serious glitchiness, so we'll quit. Yeah, let's fingers crossed this works because otherwise it's going to be a, a mad dash trying to get back to the overworld. Just so I can have them leave me alone, but even still, I think it's just an invitation to... Uh, they're going to get me. All right, uh... Arrange the tunnel. Yeah, fair enough. All right. We're going to try this, then. Alright, we're back. Oh man, it's still glitchy. Maybe it's just my internet connection. Uh, Alright, what were we doing? Oh yeah, we need to re enable that. It's the only way to test for sure if they're aggravated still is to venture out. Alright, looks like we're good for now. Hmm. Alistair, your uh, indestructible dinner is still still standing. Impressive. The dinner's like, I'm trying to give thanks, gosh darn it. Um, Alright, another act. We'll take that doll down now. Hmm. Hey, Elder Mormon, welcome to the chat. Good to have you here. We're just in the process of building the la oops. lava tunnel slash bridge. Hmm. I'm losing a bunch of that. Sort of defeats the purpose of why I'm taking this all down. That startled me a little bit. <laughs> Wasn't sure what that was. Okay, all right. Well, all right, so now we've gotten... Hmm. Doing well, very... Thank you very much, Elder Foreman. How are you doing? Best way to do this. I'm gonna go grab some more netherrack. I think the best way might be to just build, sort of build an outer shell. They haven't much. Well, I'm just gonna grab a little bit more from here because I was thinking of making this. Pretty high the entire way already. Mm. 
Actually, I wanted to keep. You like that. In case the Enderman sort of build myself a bit of an, not an ender trap, but an, an area where I can sort of stand protected from them if need be. I can hear one of those jerky jerks out here again. Oh, so my my sons and I were sort of discussing what the next approach to tree making should be, and uh, we've got an interesting one. This is what I'll do. Interesting couple plan. So, um, actually, the next next tree that I do is going to be the three high. Yeah, it's going to be for Cosmo because she has requested a a, a giant oak. in her uh, Somerville, I think it's, I believe it's called. Somerville? In her town, we're going to do a, a giant oak that will I'll just get here and do it this way. It's right next to that one. Oh, man. Yeah, our uh, our uh, Internet must be just a little be the thing that's lagging more than anything else because this is not behaving nicely. Somerville, right? Thank you, Alistair. So basically, she's going to do a bit of. I asked to see if it was okay if I talked about this. So I'm not. I'm not ruining any surprises. <laughs> so she's going to be doing a uh, bit of terraforming. I believe that would be the what would we call it? That will essentially have a river split, um, split at one point and leave sort of a, an island of land in the middle of it. And she wants to have a giant oak tree in the middle of that. So that'll be my next project. And then after that, the next tree is going to be a crimson giant. And I've decided that one's going to be. Um, that one's going to be upside down. We're going to hang that one from the ceiling and have it be a giant upside down mushroom. Why does I feel like it? How many of these do we have left? Am I blowing through them quickly? I've got plenty of stuff. Fantastic. Exactly. That is exactly the plan. Oops. Yeah, I'm pretty excited for it too. It's just, I'm curious to see how we're going to deal with it on the Citadel, because a lot of effort has gone into, I mean, I know we, they already did it going from, Alistair and Joel already sort of did the, not sure the direct technical term for it, but kind of figured out how they best wanted to chunk. Oops, all right. That's right. And this is just there. Basically, I did it with the 1015, the 1016. So we've got some some slight weird. Oops. Oh come on. Weird generations happening. Um. At some spots, like that's essentially to the left is old Nether, and to the right is new Nether. And so we're, we'll have to go way, way out in order to get any of the 1017 stuff in our world, I think. But it'll still be fun. I need to go there. Uh, wait. There. Hmm. 
Expanded world height, yeah. I'm, I honestly don't know what to expect. I guess I could just keep doing like this. No, I took care of the hardest part of it and didn't even realize it. Alright, cool. Here I am trying to figure out how I'm supposed to build back out, but it's just... This is just doing the building out, then I'm going to sort of remove the blocks. Oops. And now you need to be, since this is the foot, you need that to be a little bit wider suddenly. All right, so stay. I, keep, I, I, I sadly have forgotten about the stairs command, so I'm glad a few of you are bringing it back up. Reminding me, I've got to get some. Uh, I've got to up my game and get some more hands in there. It's 30 block tall caves to build cities in. That would be cool. Uh, making sure I did my homework there, are you? <laughs> Ender Mormon. Rightfully so, rightfully so. Make sure that I'm doing what I'm supposed to be doing. Alright, so we're gonna take you down now. Actually, I should have kept you. Hmm. This part of it here is just sort of uh, trying to figure it out as I go along type thing. No, that's too much. That might be good. Oh, we got here. That's yeah, that's weird. What does it look like? If we were just end it off with. It's not bad. <laughs> well, it's it's funny because I I can never remember from one stream to the next whether I actually placed any stairs or not, so I count them all. I go through and count them every single time. Not individually, obviously, but by, um, by stair, stair type placed. Oh, that was not right. I don't like seeing the ends of these here. Feels like I guess like unfinished. Oops. Let's see what this looks like instead. Or is that? Oh come on! I don't feel like that again. All right, which one of these is better? I don't think I like the ending like this. 
It feels like a more of a cobblestone -y look than. And this isn't bad except for that it does it conflict? Alright, let's drive one side this way and we'll go down and take a look at it. But it feels like it's conf horizontal conflicting with vertical, which I don't think I like. But Well, it's not too bad. It's a less, of, less of a natural look and more of a uh, fabricated look. I mean, that's not as bad. All right. I know I put all that stuff. To oh my gosh. At least I thought I was going to pour in for a second there. Just now I'm wondering if I should have just done it all like vertically like that. I almost like the look of this better than seeing the uh, these ends. I guess the real question: Does it look like a fallen tree? Because I mean, if it doesn't, then I gotta. Maybe I'm better off just doing the entire thing as warped wood. I wanted it to look like it was a dead tree, but maybe, uh... Oh, man. Stay far enough away. The... It doesn't really look like a... It looks too... Grained, like it looks like there's too much of a an, an intentional green. It looks like a fabricated green as opposed to natural wood green. And that's a big, that's a drag. Because that's not what I intended. Cute. All right, let's try taking half of it down. Side by side like this, it looks pretty good. Pretty pleased with it, but I, what I'm going to try is actually not necessarily um, sorry. Words are failing me right now. I'm going to just try to put a bunch of non-polished basalt next to each other. To see what that looks like from above. Sorry, what was that, CJ? Uh... Yeah. I might put, I, my thinking is this is supposed to be a, a warped wood, so I don't want I don't want to mix any crimson into it because it's supposed to be a my my thinking is that it's a dead warped wood tree. I like the color, but I just want it to be. Uh... <laughs> Words are hard. I'm not gonna be able to get those ones from way up there. All right, so let's take this so that looks like from above already liking the way it looks side by side for the walls Oops. 
That's what we have on us right now. Let's just check and see what this looks like. That's true. Hmm. Well, I'm 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 I'm, I'm unsure. The crimson stems looked. Yeah, maybe. All right. Well, well, well. Let's actually. I have some warp stem on me. Let's just try to in place some of that in. Maybe it's a mixture of the two that's going to be going what happens. This is just really obviously not paying attention to it, just trying to... Oops. Uh... I might end up putting some. I'm on. I'll probably end up putting some, some warped, warped wood stairs or warped wood in it anyway because I want to have some. Maybe that's what I need to do is just do a combination of all three. Instead of being just straight up one kind or the other, always going across. Having some of the warped wood in it is pretty interesting. All right, that's what we're doing next. We're gonna take down a bunch of stuff and then just make it a mishmash of stuff. One, th one thing that would be nice is I can do the, what are they called, the uh, warped hyphae, where it's you know same texture on all sides, so I could cap some of these off at the, the ends with the, uh, the hyphae, and it would be kind of nice. Too many of the same kind in a row. Mix and match, mix and match. Oops. Huh, I'm actually, I have a pickaxe on me. I wasn't dealing with wood for a little while, but perhaps I should go get one. Yes, these uh, sand will have to come out and become stairs shortly. Yeah, so got all kinds of weird lagging is going on. That's after a restart, so it's gotta be gotta be the internet tonight. Hooray, hooray! Um. 
Here. We'll finish that off with a high fit at the end. I'm gonna bring some of this stuff up this side. We ain't got so much up here. Alright. Oops. Man. Rookie mistake. Alright, let's get a sense of what that looks like. Well, then I'm gonna have to eat some food because of this. 8-bit boy is on the hungry side there. Oh. So, a bit more interesting anyway. It looks weird with the sand on the outside and the... the, uh... that red stuff, whatever that... <laughs> my goodness, I can't even... Netherrack. Because, uh... not supposed to be there. It's going to go away. All right, let's see if we can see this ghast this time before it sees us. Really, you just can sink in the lava? There we go. All right, so for you, we're going to probably destroy our pickaxe, taking these last few off. I'm going to need to get some. Let's go get some more hyphae now. I do want some parts of this actually to be open. All right, we need to get the pickaxe. Since we have to head over and get some more um, stuff anyway. Do I have the pickaxe? I do. Oh my gosh, almost, things are almost... almost gone over here. Might be worthwhile taking a moment and going to... get those special tools that Cosmic made me, finally. I've been sort of reluctant to bring them over because I didn't want to lose them, but... Well, oh wait, do I have Blackstone here? I forgot. Nope. Alright, so we have to go over and get some blackstone. Right, we're gonna head back to I'm running low on food for one. Which is not entirely true. I have Alistair's Thanksgiving get thanks thanks. Can't even talk. Alistair's Thanksgiving dinner. I should transpose upstairs. Alright, so we're gonna do a bit of a Just dump so we can bring Alistair's stuff upstairs. Because he made me this lovely Thanksgiving dinner. And the, car the carrots in this one were the, uh, the nice food gift I forgot about. So I need to move this all upstairs so that it doesn't get blown away. I'm not sure where I'm going to put it yet, but anything's better than leaving it out there to get blown up again since it's been numerous close calls. Oh. Happy Shranksgiving! That's what it sounds like when you've had plenty to drink. <laughs> Shranksgiving. All right. Just number one, taking care of.
No, please don't shoot at me when I'm out here. Me too. I honestly am. Oh, that was so not the right one. Oh, Steven, Steven, Steven. Why you gotta be that way? Yeah, it's, it's, those should have not survived a long time ago. <laughs> Met their demise a long time ago. Um, Thanksgiving turkey, delicious. Oh, Thanksgiving jack and potatoes, nice. Cake, put the cake right there for now. Thanksgiving stew, turkey. It is. There's a. There is. Main course. Oh, let it go. Dessert. Oh. From Alistair. And starter. There's the stew for the starter. Nice. We we're running into exactly the same situation we had before, where we just got stuff <laughs> and nowhere to put any of it. No joy. Uh, that's fine for now. You pot fire potion. I'm gonna need a couple of you in a moment. Okay, I believe that's good. Oh, sorry, I missed some of the chat there. I was just sort of focused on what I was doing. I think the Warden is an excellent idea, and it is going to terrify the crap out of me. I've got enough uh, things I need to worry about on a regular basis, let alone something that is a silent killer that's meant... Yeah, exactly. Do not sneeze, every repeat. Do not sneeze. Actually, I meant to take a look at that from up here. Bear with me, I'm going to give up. <laughs> Clearly. We keep getting emails from that CJ guy. We gotta, gotta step it up a little bit. All right, so it's looking a little patchworky. That's kind of okay, I guess. The sides will need to be done a little bit. They're looking. Now that the top's looking patchworky, that's which is sort of fine. The sides look a little bit too uniform gray. I'm gonna have to do something about that. All right. Well, now that the I'm gonna go try and take down the netherrack. I think so. Bit of cleanup time now. Wait a second, what did I do with the, the door? The dua. I made a door. Or to just create a door and walk away from the door. That sounds like something I would do. Probably never even made it. Yeah. Probably never even made a door. Maybe make sure there isn't more than two. Yes, true. I, I don't know that I mind it, like, occasionally three and stuff like that, but you're right. In, in the walls and the outside, for sure, because they're only in three. They're three chunk. Um, three block chunk, so if three of them were in a row, we would definitely put a line. Oops, 
there. Although that is a massive drag to have it in the way. The basalt has become your least favorite? Interesting. I am finding it tough because it's hard to hide. Like even here when you've got this stuff next to each other, it's this one con fairly continuous texture. But I wish that these ones... I wish they weren't so linear. That's what you mean, I'm not sure. Oh my gold pants... Do oh my gosh, my gold pants are almost done. Almost done! Alright, well, I do need some food, so I'm going to head back and grab some. Grab some food, grab some gold so I can make some more more pants. And I'm going to grab uh, some more diamond tools that Cosmic made me. I do believe I have some blackstone there, so I'm going to go. Alright, Mr. McFly. Thank you. Oh my goodness, seriously? Thank you once again sir, for joining the stream. Always appreciated. Uh... Oh, goodness. Fine. Have a good night, Alistair. <laughs> Sorry that it was right in the middle of me getting slaughtered. I will 100% need to work on my aim. Have a good night, Alistair. <laughs> Pun! Yeah, bang pun, that'd be fantastic if, if uh, there was uh, a random pun that showed up. <laughs> Fair enough. Whoa. I don't even have any shaders on. Last time I was having a bit of issues with the. Uh, Bad connection, and then shaders on top of that slow the entire thing down, but right now we have zero excuses. That's cool, though. Actually, I'm seeing way down the hallway. Do I have a shader on? I do not. Well, I'll get the internal one on, but that's fine. We are down to the last little bit of foods. Uh oh. Am I gonna get booted off the server again? Looks like it. Good. Alright, weird connection night, folks. I apologize again. I guess the only thing I didn't do to try to ensure a good connection was to restart my computer fresh from, uh, yeah, fresh. Just shut down from work and restarted everything. Alright, let's see what we got here for gold. I thought I had some, but I do not. I will take that black stone, though. Oops. We have some gold ore, so I'll take that. Alright, and I do believe I've got some gold upstairs here. Thank you, very kindly, sir. I'm very... It's funny, though, I've been down in the nether so long that I do forget about it, so that when I come in and I see the abyss, every time I come in, I'm like, ah, yeah. Looks fantastic. Very pleased with how it turned out. And there's some gold. I do believe I've got some, or I thought I had some straight up gold anyway, not just gold ore. Um. Well, there's a. Uh, Clearly that's not the case. I 
Blackness, Blackstone. Regular Blackstone up here? Or is that. Oh. Alright, let's go upstairs. Outside. We haven't been outside in a long time. Actually, a stack of Alistair's British Jacket Potatoes. Oh, right. And then that's for my birthday two years ago. Gift of Cosmic's Death. Or Cosmic's Gift of Death. Oh, I will take those. And they will be handy. We're just going and scouring for gold so that since my pants are about to fall off, <laughs> which is totally inappropriate. You Darth Vader's Darth Vader's death watch. No kidding. It's funny because I had it had been outside. Not sure if any of you were on the stream when it happened, but Cosmic's gift of flowers were here. Basically right there for the longest time and we didn't even realize it until one time Alistair was standing here then a baby zombie jumped on it and tore right after him over there. And uh, both of us died. Twice. Oh yes, and the stair, fa and the stair fairy. I need to come back. Oh, wait a those? Look at that. Nice. Actually, these stairs will come in handy when I create Cosmic's Oak Tree. Good, good. Alright, so not nearly as much gold up here as I thought I had, but some. But most importantly, we have Alistair's British Jacket Potatoes. Fantastic. Alright, so we're going to go... You were there, that's right. Oh, it was the... That's right, it was the night that we were going to go do the, the dragon fight. And Alistair and I each died twice from that thing, right at the beginning. It was pretty amazing. Oh, no, wait. Uh... Actually, the uh, I forgot to mention Ender Mormon, the uh, the glass floor. I had some texture pack or some shaders on the other day, and it made the glass look super reflective. It was pretty darn spectacular. Nether bricks, not nether. We want blackstone. Of course, we don't have blackstone. When we want blackstone, block of coal is good. Of course, why would anyone have Blackstone? Oh well. Move the coal here. I do need to come down here one of these days and do some uh, enchanting. I have yet to do so. No. Oops. Oh, right. Okay. Now I remember where there's some gold. Actually, maybe I'll turn the shader on quickly down there. It just may bring my entire Minecraft experience <laughs> to a halt, given how it's going. Not wish to happen, but... I forgot that uh, I have a storage room up here that I visit very infrequently. Because it's the one that has zero organization to it. Oh, diamond shovel. That's handy. Okay. Lots. I want to try to remember that. Oh, gold. Oh my goodness. Those boots. Break into protector. Nice. I could then forget. Can you melt down old? Old armor? I don't think you can. Oh, come on, please, server, don't disconnect me. I'm trying to be good. Alright, well. And then we want to go up one level. Of course, it's 
blackstone bricks. Not what we want. Although, glowstone, that's interesting for possible lighting inside the tunnel. And this is a, a gift from Cosmic. Sorry you died, and then I laughed. So she felt bad, so she made this amazing stuff for me. So I've got um, die pickaxe bending and then breaking. So I'm going to bring that down with the hope that I do not uh, obviously fall in, um, in the lava with it. I'm going to leave... Uh, I'm going to bring... I'm not sure. I'm super indecisive, clearly. Unbreaking 3. Power 3 and breaking 3. That's pretty good. Maybe I'll just keep that on me. I'll have to go do some... Uh... Hey, Doc. Coming in? Alright. You don't break the place when I'm gone. So, oh yes. Because I too would like to see what it looks like. We're going to do a quick um, shaders viewing here. I really like the way it looked. I wish I wish there was enough bandwidth and everything to uh, allow it to keep working. Shadas, that's right. You have, sorry, under... There we go. just think it looks so cool. Nice reflection leading up to here as well. Super schmancy. Thanks, CJ. Pretty pleased with it. I actually I like the for the lighting as well. It may actually work okay down here now that I'm Actually, thank you for the reminder, CG. That's one product I have not decided on yet, but it's something I definitely need to address. So these are the Silders. What are they called? Silder shaders, I believe. I tried a bunch of, the, a bunch of them the other day. Yeah, Silder shaders, and this has been my favorite one. Because it actually doesn't make... Uh, there are actually some other ones that look, I would say, nicer. My broom closet. <laughs> yeah. There's uh, definitely they they definitely look nicer, but this one actually looks the best in the Nether. I thought the other ones look super glowy orange, orange, and this one just makes everything look brighter. Right? And it takes the weird shadows off of lava. Like looking at this, you'd have one bright side and one side of lava in shade, and and really, who's got? Who's got lava in shade? I mean, how is lava, a light source, going to have one side be in light and one in shade? I just want to see if I can... See if I can mend this bow a little bit. Yeah, that glass texture is just nice. All right. Let's see if I can actually see any skeletons this time. Last time they were hard to find. It's funny. I'm just sitting up in my chair, seeing, basically trying to look over, see if I can see anything, but I can't. Huh. Nothing to ransack today, apparently. All right, well, that's a bit of a drag. Open to, uh... Hope 
hoping to be able to carry many to Totally not advertising. It's funny though because Firepith and Frostburn, the two of you have only been on here a couple of times and you remember where everything is way better than I do. It's it's almost embarrassing, but so there you have it. Um You guys just remember better than your old man does. You know where most things are. <laughs> ah, ha, ha. Of course. Oh yeah, here's the, uh, the shader in the desert. Quite like this. Oops. Well, it's nighttime, so let's... Uh... Oh no. Thankfully... As I've, I've only just discovered. Ah! That was close. What are you folks gonna drop? Come on. You're not gonna drop anything? Oh, what a waste. I do need a sleep reminder. Did they not drop a thing? Really? That's a lot of creepers out here. Nope. Nobody nope. Bye! <laughs> I just wanted to show the nice folks the lighting. There's no need to get into a fight right now. Alright. Oh yeah, so the... The Silver Shaders takes the sun and throws it off to the side. It still has a... Uh, it doesn't make a realistic sun, which I like. I still like the pixelized clouds. I like the pixelized sun. It's true. It's true. No, I know. I was hoping for a um, phantom membrane or something. They just pour them in the sky that all disintegrate. And nothing from them. Yeah, the, the motion blur is way more obvious when the frames, the FPS drops. One thing that's funny about this is like with this, these shaders on, I can see all the way to the end. There's no, there's basically no atmospheric drop off. Oh my goodness, I'm a dummy. I went down there to get gold. All right, well, I guess I'm going to uh, see what I can do with the gold ore that I have. That was stupid. All these gas here are eventually just going to tear away the entire landscape. I'm trying to put a fire where the easiest way to actually just build a little bit of this landscape back up. All right. Just build the tower, just let those... I do enjoy battling them. It's if you can find a sweet spot to... For a while there, it's whenever they would come near me on my... When I was working on my tree, I would just battle them. CJ's perfectly placed there. And since we're talking that way, Alistair's British Jacket Potatoes! There we go. What happened to my sword? Actually, I've got an anvil. I should just... mend the gold boots I have or something. Um, Alright, let's... uh.
this is where it's going to get a bit weird because I do like I don't want it to be crazy uniform but I like I prefer having these uh, vertically as the ends as opposed to this I don't really care to look at that Maybe we can just sort of take a look at this and see what that's like. Maybe that's all I'll do, just mix that up a little bit. Hey Turtle, welcome to the chat. Glad you can make it. Glad you can make it for sure. Got a good turnout tonight. I appreciate you all dropping by. No worries, Ender Mormon. I'm glad you're able to stop by. Have yourself a great night, and we will catch you another time. Oh, you're getting two months now. Nice, Turtle. Way to go. That's awesome. Appreciate the support. Oh, Turtle, thanks. Thank you so much. Much appreciated. That's awesome. I thought you were telling me you had already gotten your two months, but that's... I... Oh, what happened there? That was weird. Oh, I said Ender Mormon. <laughs> Fair enough. Elder. Elder Mormon. Have yourself a great night. Thank you so is that what I said? I said Ender Mormon? <laughs> That's hilarious. Okay, yeah, no worries, Turtle. That's an awesome thing to share. I'm trying to figure out my. Um, building a tunnel between one side of. The lava to the other and I'm trying to make it look like a, a fallen tree although I'm having mixed success with that I'm just trying to figure out the best way to, to do it everything's looking a little bit too uniform so I've got to try to not <laughs> have it that have it that way I'm gonna mix up as much as possible All right. Hey, the black sheep. Hey, how's it going? Welcome. Been a while. We're currently, we're, how are you doing? We're currently working on a tunnel. That is intended to look like a dead tree. It's sort of coming along, but it's uh, not as... The salt is not as forgiving as I would have liked because it's, its grain is very specific. It's not... Um, ah, cool. What sort of play do you have planned for the night? Are you doing a survival or... Nice. Well, that, that's pretty. That's pretty rad, actually. Appreciate everyone who stopped by. I enjoy the streaming regardless, but it's just so much nicer when people have popped by and want to hop in the chat and be part of the conversation. It just makes it go. It's just a lot more interesting for for me, and I find uh, even when I get sort of caught up with what I'm doing, 
gives you all a chance to chat with each other as well. This is really nice. Alright, and then that. Survival tonight. Solar survival. Cool. Nice. I, I understand, I'm the same way sometimes too. I find that I like the Citadel. And, and well, I do love the Citadel, but sometimes I just think, oh, I'd love to go back onto um, my own world and just see what I can come up with. It's all good. Do I have any more of that on me? Much more? I don't. I will have to go get some more warp wood soon. Just go get some because I will need it. I want to make some some more warped hyphae because that's what's going to be handier overall. And I know I've got a bunch of that. Uh, I say a bunch, but not a lot of warp stem there. I thought I had more. Oh, I must have put some more upstairs. Let's take half of that, or roughly half of that. Make some high fade. No? Oh, alright, head back in. Actually, now that we're speaking of hyphae, let's just place it on the bottom here because that looks good. Funny, now that I've uh, put on the shaders, it feels like everything's a little bit less laggy. Gonna hunt for diamonds and then. And then ready. Nice. That sounds like a fun night. That's your homework. That's all the homework you have for tonight, Turtle. Is the uh, math nice? Oh, it's nice. I was like having a a light a light homework night is always an enjoyable one. Wait a second, I forgot again. Take care of this gold situation before it's too late, or at least start cooking the gold. Make sure again that I don't have any gold down here that I'm missing. All right. Uh, where'd it go? Oh, here it is. Going blind. And I'm gonna make as much. Oops, not you. You. Three. Or I'll at least be able to. I'll at least be able to get boots out of this. Oh, well that's good. I don't know why, but my brain was expecting for me to get gold nuggets instead of gold ingots. This is, uh, this is way better. Oh, cool. alright, I guess we're just going to go straight ahead and make some gold pants then. Or... <laughs> to the me, we are not. We're going to wait one more. There we go. Now we're going to make some gold pants. There we go. Awesome. I don't think that three left. I don't think that armor actually makes any noise when it breaks, does it? It just sort of disappears. It's weird. Sat down a few times. Ah, oh, nice. Your teacher was showing. Oh, sorry, turtle. I missed that. Your teacher was showing you their Minecraft world as well. Uh, sounds like a pretty cool teacher. <laughs> uh... What am I doing here? Oh, good. There's a gas. Oh goody, a ghastly. Um, the whoops, hi fair right there.
You know, there's gonna be a bit of a problem. I need to push that back a tiny bit. Hmm. Oh, don't do that. Don't do that. We need that. Alright, that's good. Oh, now we need the bow. Where'd the bow go? Because we've got something out here looking to mess with us. The plan is to mess with it first. Of course, now I can't see it. Oh, me oh my. Alright, that's fine. Fine, fine, fine. Um, I'll put that there. Alright, so I'm just trying to trying to figure this out. This is basically gonna be a lot of just messing around until it feels like it's got something working for it. It's not a bad patchworky wall. Going vertical with that, going vertical with that seems a bit weird. Oh, Turtle, you've got... <laughs> CJ's the band guy. He'll have all the questions for you. Oh, wait, that's going to be the high fade. Because that's going to be at the end. That's one thing I have to remember, is that... Thy viol is not a band instrument. I'm sorry, I apologize. Alright, well what's... okay. At the risk of sounding snarky, why don't you enlighten us on what the difference between uh, a band instrument and an orchestra instrument is. No, Steven. No. <laughs> We've gone too far, have I? Uh, I'm gonna regret that again. Come on. There we go. No pigs running at me? No pigs running at me. Amazing. Well, I was just trying to add to the musical conversation, but clearly I am a uh, an ill-equipped linguistically to take in such conversations if I can't even if I don't even know that it's a uh, viol is not a band instrument. Oh, there we go, band instrument. Any instrument played in a band. Violin, viola, cello, basses are orchestral instruments as they only played in orchestras and smaller. Huh. That is cool. Would never have known. Yeah, me too. Cello's 
one of my favorite sounds. What am I doing here? Right. And you off, although you seem to be too many, too many in a row. That's pretty good for variety on the top. Hmm. Oops, sorry, I missed that. And then black sheep. Enchantments are. And yeah, no, sorry, black sheep, I missed that. But in terms of enchantments, I'm the same way. I'm so. Such an enchantment. Just say noob, but I've not actually even done them before, so anything that I've got that's got an enchantment on it, somebody has done for me, so it just feels like something I definitely need to spend some time on. Oh, hey, favorite there, because that'll be good. Grainless block. Hmm. Should probably practice now. <laughs> nice. I'm going to be in a marching band next year. That's awesome. My father used to be in a in a marching band. He loved it. He was the drummer. Let's take that one out. This is where it's going to be a little bit slow going. I've got the entire shape looking the way I want. Well, the entire shape is what I want it to be, but. Um, and that's going to be a matter of sort of fine tuning the. Uh, the end pieces and stuff. Yeah, me too. Makes it a lot. I, I, I love all the chatting going on. Makes me happy. Ooh, cool. What kind of pasta are you having? Now we're all waiting for your pasta to cook. <laughs> oh, I'm on the out of that, so I need to go. I guess I need to get some more. funny there's part of me that really likes the way it looks all shredded to pieces like that let's take a look to see what oh, that's salmon oh wow that sounds delicious excuse me okay this is definitely looking more interesting than it did a little while ago all right, Turtle, have a great practice, and thank you again for stopping by. As per usual, always a pleasure to have you join the chat. Actually, what I, knew, I know what I need to do. I need to flare up the other side of it. Sort of done... Sort of flared up this end of it a little bit, like the root. But I did not do that at the other end. Oh, right, actually, now that I think of it. Okay, bear with me, folks. I'm going to head over and get some more basalt, because I do need some. But I'm also going to head over and get some more blackstone. I want to mix and match in the floor a little bit.
Thankfully, these shaders are not giving me much grief at all over here. Uh, I'm just curious what's over here. I was just say maybe I should make a bridge over to that area, but that's actually over along where that's where we sort of did the blackstone harvesting before. Let's get away from that there, gassed. That's awesome. Oops. Wrong direction. I don't want to get stuck down there. One of the things I keep forgetting about down here is the dangers. Are those magma cubes. They've already killed me once in this stream and almost knocked me off another time. So, you have to be careful. Hmm. I've uh, usually been okay with them, but this stream I've learned to strongly, strongly dislike them. <laughs> I wonder what the best spot to get Blackstone from is. I guess it's going to be right along here, but I really don't want to go at everything that's right, that's sort of encasing the lava in. Need to be, I guess, inch my way down and be careful. They're so spongy and cute until they try to shove you off into the lava. At which point their cuteness factor drops exponentially. And this dude here is going to try to come up and get me. Trying to ruin my Tuesday, aren't you? <laughs> Fair enough. Let's do this a little bit. Texas, in case we should fall. I should be doing that from up here, so I can see. Alright, so, geez, time check. I can't believe it's already almost quarter to ten. Well. I wonder if I can take this down one level. I would like to do that. Yeah, let's take this entire thing down one. And that should leave us with a, uh, hey, a nice clean way of getting out of here. Like that. And leave us with some nice resources. And our back. I'll just leave that little wall over there so that it's not easy, not easy to fall off. Almost like we've got our own ourselves in a little very intentional pathway. Just fingers crossed we don't run into any lava. Oh come on. I guess this is one side downside of the shader without the fog on. It's you can see way off to the point where the rendering is not showing up anymore, which is a bit of a drag.
have to play around with the levels to find out what I can, while I use them, find out what I can use at a safe distance. That'll still give me decent performance. Right now I feel like I'm doing a bit of a lagging, but overall much better than being above ground and with the lag that's up there. Alright, we're replacing the floor. We have plenty of, oh my goodness, we have tons of blackstone, that was good. More than we needed. Basically, it's now just again doing a really trying to come up with a pattern that's going to look intentional. Ah, uh, that is, you know, I mean, as random as you can make it look with intentionally doing it. Alright, let's see how this looks. Not bad. Well, the sand here is a little bit out of place. Oops, that was super not intentional. Hmm. I'm gonna make that the So not cool, man. Um, oops. Pretty good. I don't really just don't want any sand in any of the corners. I think overall I want it to look be mostly the salt floor. Having the black rear it's pretty good. Alright, now let's, uh, I guess, continue on with what we were doing here. Yeah, this is going to be literally trying to patchwork our way through this entire thing. Weird. Everything that I've done now, I'm just tearing it apart. All right. Well, in the end, it'll look good. Maybe I should just fo gonna focus on finishing off this wall over here because otherwise, it's gonna be a game of you know starting one starting one project but never finishing it. And then we can go here. Wait, is that right? That feels very wrong. 
One, two, three. Yeah, there's one, two, four. Taking things too far, Steven. Alright. Means you've got to be a hyphae. I keep forgetting what it's called, but now that I've got it mentally, I'm at the, the tip of my tongue. I love the word. What am I doing? It's so wrong. This is not. <laughs> okay, so. And then one, two. I'm out of control here, folks. I apologize. Who oh, losing track? And another brick fence? Maybe. Let's try that. Look at that. It's wrong. Well, that's why that's throwing me off. You're not supposed to be there. Lava level. That's, it's tough because it's... it's. I love the basalt because it looks like dead tree. But... It just looks too uniform. And so, a little bit disappointing. Hmm. Oops. One, two, three. You go there. That means you can go there. Uh, it's funny though because you mentioned it, but I'm I'm actually not super familiar with all the ins and outs of the texture pack either. That's a pretty good wall. Or did it not? Oh, I didn't put a hyphen there, did I? Put a log. Yeah, okay, that's what it is. Oh, that's what my. Are you a log as well? Yep, that's not good. You're supposed to be like that, and then like that. There we go. That's better. That is better. Let's do log. I There's a bunch of it collected all together, but that's fine. This is fine. I forgot I want to keep some of it wide open. If you remember that, I'm going to leave that open. Just need to be careful to not, <laughs> not make it look like every shape is the same. I say that because I had taken out a chunk of the blocks here. Is exactly the same as the chunks of block you're taking out over there. Alright. Nope, that's not good. Can't be leaving holes around.
Leave that open. Alright. Now we can get this wall finished off what we want it to be for the night, and then. And that'll be that. Let's see if we can just clean up this outside here. And get a sense of what this one's gonna look like when it's done. That's wrong. You need to. All right, we'll have to flare that up next time. Oh no, let's go. Let's go up the tree and take a look at what that looks like because it's sort of the safest spot to end. Since we're almost at the end, let's just do that. Take a peek from up here. All right, well, folks, I think this is where I'm going to say uh, good night because it is just on the cusp of ten. Oops, ten o'clock, which is my normal time to bow out. So, actually, that's looking a lot better. Yeah, the, the, now that I'm looking at it again, I think I've got to put some holes in the ceiling as well. Actually, I lied. I am not going to end here. I want to take a look at it from the other end because I, I cleared off all that nether rack so that I could have a look. Thanks, CJ. I think so as well. It's just... Nope. I love the idea of just using basalt so that it looks like it's dead. Deader. But it's just not doing it for me. I'm going to take these out because I'm going to flare it up. I forgot. Alright. I'll just go to the other side. Yeah, this side's looking a little too uniform, so I just wanted to get a, a good sense of what it's going to be. Hey CJ, you have yourself a wonderful evening as well. Oops. Okay. Too far over. Yeah, that's definitely better. Although like I said, I'm going to I'm going to clear out huge areas of the ceiling now that I've seen it again. Because it's just looking too closed in. Thanks, Black Sheep. You as well. All right, everyone. We'll just do it right here. Good to see you all. Have yourselves a wonderful night. Uh, there's actually my watch saying it's time to stop. So we are going to stop. Um, all this vi this video is going to be on YouTube uh, tomorrow night, 24 hours from now, over at Steven ESC as well. Guten Nacht. Is that how you... Guten Nacht. Cool. Good night, y'all. Um, yeah, I'm also over on Twitter at Steven ESC as well. And since notifications don't seem to be going out in a timely fashion from Twitch, if you want to stay up to date on when we go live or changes to the schedule and whatnot, I've got a Discord channel you can join. The link is down in the About section. Have yourselves all a wonderful night, and we'll catch you next stream which will be Thursday evening. Oh, and just a heads up, I will not be streaming Sunday evening because I've got a crazy weekend of work ahead of me, so no stream Sunday. Have yourselves a wonderful night, and we will see you Thursday. Take care, everyone.